Hi and welcome to this quick tip video test using Snagit's video capture tool. Once the MP4 is created from this session with audio, it'll be uploaded to Screencast for streaming out to the end users. I'm just going to do a little navigation around site settings for this particular SharePoint native site. You'll notice that site settings is accessed from the top right of the uh, screen as opposed to the top left how it was in 2010. And we'll go down to site settings. And in site settings, we're going to take a look at a few things. The first thing is going to be the navigation options for the site. So I'll give a click on navigation, and you're going to see the navigation settings as far as global and current navigation, some rules around display, and the management of navigation and structure. But I'm interested in coming down a little bit on the screen here to the structure of the actual menu items that are on it. Anything that's in the global navigation is going to be in the top drop down, global to the site. Current navigation tends to be the left quick launch menus and they're kind of specific to the particular page that you're in at the time. So I've got a few global navigation items here. Site icons, solution deployment, and site images which are just links to other pages that are in this particular site. If I click on one in particular, like Solution Deployment, and then I click on Edit, you'll be able to see the actual edit screen for it. So you'll see the title, the URL, description, things like that. So we'll close out of that, and then we'll close out of Site Settings for Navigation by clicking Cancel at the top right, and then we'll finish this up by going to the SharePoint Native homepage site again. We'll stop the recording to see the quality of the audio as well as the video. Thanks a lot.